How is it going everyone? My name is Ruska and I'll be showing off this Torko V decklist. This whole card is about to attack Steam Crush, we just, which does 120 damage and discards 2 energies attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. This means that you can attack, detach a lot. It's not even detach, it's discard. Keep that in mind, discard. So, there are multiple ways you can play this. You can either just completely block them from attacking because they don't have any, they don't have enough energy acceleration to actually be able to get more than two energies onto their Pokemon in a round. Or you can just deck them out with the energies. If they don't have any energies and they can't get their energies back into their deck, then they're, then they're screwed. They can't do a thing then. And then they will just have to concede because I will be doing 120 each turn. So that's the way how you play this. You don't look at the HP, you look at the amount of energies attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. If that Pokemon is not active, I've been thinking about it, if that Pokemon is on the pitch, like for example they put a bulky Pokemon in active spot and then they uh, attach an energy to one of their bench Pokemon so they can attack the next turn. Now what do you do then? You know, people would say, ah, oh, use a boss's order, but we don't use a boss's order here, nah nah nah. What we use here is a Ninetales. This Ninetales is very consistent. The reason for this is it's an ability. You can use it whenever you want after you play a supporter. And you can also just reuse it if you uh, are able to get a fire energy or get some energies from your deck with a giant half. And then you are able to use your Ninetales ability. And this is just a very consistent way to hunt down that energy. And if you manage to do this consistently each turn, then you are fine, you are completely fine and they will not be able to get an attack off and eventually all their energy is just in their discard pile and they can't do a thing. Um, a lot of decks like, for example, Eternatus don't have any energy recycle ways. Eternatus plays more, normally plays like 4 energies of the hidden, then 4 capture energies and then some normal basic energies. But in general they don't really play that much energy since Eternatus uses. Uh, attack cost has an attack cost of two, so that's why it's actually a very good matchup to play against the Eternatus and also Sand Scorch. But the thing is with Sand Scorch is that it has a lot of energy as like acceleration, so the discarding two energies it doesn't really matter, and that's where the problem with this card lies. But in the most, like in general, this card really performs well. Like today, I've been playing almost a whole day with this deck and I have noticed that it's actually possible to get a big uh, win streak. Uh, today I got a win streak of 9 and uh, yeah it really was a lot of fun and I played two events which one I lost at the second round and the other I won the final so it just really depends on what your opponent is. I have also managed to win against this Decidueye and took Obstagoon. The thing is with Obstagoon is it does only prevent damage it does prevent the effect of discarding two energies so when you discard those two energies it probably can't attack next turn which means you are in victory since you can then attack and do damage and discard the energy that they attached again so yeah this this card really performs well in standard that's what i see okay so we have two two line of nine tails to get it in play we don't need too many we only need one on the bench and that's it um you have to watch out for your bench base in this deck Okay. Um, since we discard energies and our damage output is not that big with 120 each turn, we can raise it a little bit with our rare fossil and then eventually arc assault, which puts two that put, put, which puts two damage counters on your opponent's Pokemon that uh, that gets an energy attached to them from the hand. So that means with a welder, that's four energy, four damage counters just from those two energies because they come from the hands. Uh, but yeah, that's a good way to actually accelerate your NGs. Since you will be discarding them, they have to at keep attaching them back and back. We run three Drachis. These are very consistent. You want to start with these to get your Nine Tails, your, uh, your Arc Assault, just to get everything set up. You need those Drachis, mate. Then we have one the Danny and one Crowbar, just the extra consistency. It's needed if you want to make sure that we can be, we are able to get a good hand. If we are not. Uh, we are screwed. I've, I've seen plays where both of these are priced and it's pretty tough to set up if you then have a dead hand. You can't do a thing then. But yeah, these are the things. Uh, the Pokemon. And then we have of course our four crushing hammers. 
we only played three fire crystal i found that four is just a little too many and actually at the end of the game i always just ended up using my third and it, it, it's always very close like i'm getting close to not having any energies left to play with but it's always only at the end of the game so it's pretty good that yeah it's just enough it's just about enough and then we have four quake balls to get our basics in play uh, both the Denage, Acrobat, Rochi, Torkoal, all of those you can get them with the Quick Ball. And the Quick Ball can be used to discard and then later on get it back with a Fire Crystal so you don't lose anything that way as well. Then we have three copies of Rare Fossil. Since you can't start with these, it doesn't matter if you have three of them. So I, I like that about this. Then we run three switches. It's enough to like switch out your Jirachi to play again with Torkoal. We also run three giant halves. These are very handy to get them in play to use for your both welder and nine tails, or just to uh, thin out your deck to higher your odds of pulling and better things with Drachi or just from top decking. Then we run three copies of Marnie. These three copies of Marnie are just handy to set up, and later on in the game you won't really be using them unless you really want to um, destroy the hand of your opponent. And then we use uh, two professors research to completely destroy that, that hand and get a fresh one, a fresh start. This is only needed in like, uh, this is only used in like the last choice because you don't want to discard your cards of course, but yeah. It's only your last choice when you have no other way to go. And then we also run four welders of course. Four, yeah, I mean, it's a good acceleration, it's good draw, it's everything you need mate. Then we also run three burning scarf. Now I have found these burning scarf to be the actual destroyer of, uh, of, of all those damage preventing decks. Since I keep discarding the energies, and every time they attack, they get burned. For some reason, they die from the burn. <laughs> it's it's insane. They all have died from the burn. It's it's crazy. But yeah, this burn actually helps you out to finish those uh, big targets off. Uh, yeah, that's it. Then we also run two copies of heat energy. I only run two because I want all those energies to be able to be played with giant half, nine tails, welder, fire crystal. Because those special energies you can't use them with all those other things, you know. But those two energies are very handy if you want to higher you raise your uh, HP. So yeah, I found that two, having two in play uh, in the deck is actually very fun and good and consistent as well. And then in total we run 12 fire energies. Now this was the deck, and I will move on to some gameplay last. Alright, so let's start off. Oh, we lose the coin flip. Oh, that's sad. I normally always pick heads, man. Heads is the best. Here, I'll, I'll, let, I'll let you go second. <laughs> Courtesy. Well, I don't, I don't use a whole canyon in this deck. Uh, I never really liked, liked like the Volcanium. the idea of Volcanion. Volcanion is really, Volcanion is, is really good. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's this deck again? Sorry, what? Uh, I don't think I've played with it yet. It, it's now Torkoal. It's, okay, it's not the Groudon Mega. <laughs> nah, it's not Groudon Mega, no. <laughs> Uh, okay, so what can I do here? Alright, I'll do this. Ah, yeah, yeah, so Eternatus with some other types, right? With like, other Pokemon like Grimmsnarl. Actually, I think I don't go for Volcanion since I really want Drudges, but I've never been a fan of, of Volcanion in the first place. It's just not my kind of card, since you can only use it on your second turn, and then after that it's basically useless. You can do some damage, yes, but... Yeah. But of course, that's not the whole reason why it's like existence. You, you just have to use it on a second, and then after that you can use it to attack or something. But yeah, that's, that's completely not what I'm going for with this deck. 
it's mainly focused on actually, instead of going for the kills, it's going for the energies. Ah, uh, um, it's a uh, Kiawe, Kiawe, but it's uh, expanded at this point. I don't know what set it's from, but it's from Western Moon. Sorry? Yeah, it's expanded. It's a little old one. He is very broken indeed, it's, it's, it's insane. The fact that you get it from the deck as well, <laughs> Jesus. Oh man, I regret discarding the world instead of the money. Because like, I was thinking, okay, so I have four uh, worlds in this deck. What should I do? So. Well, I do have the money. I discarded the world. <laughs> I needed the world so at that point, so I could just completely charge it up. Alright, let's give me a hat. Oh, god damn. Okay, so okay, I'm gonna wait at this point. So you go for the knockout. Well, that's a little overkill. You discard your energies, you know. Ah, okay, okay. No, well, well, thought of, well thought of. Yeah, that's, that's pretty well thought of. Oh, I forgot it actually just puts it right there. Well, yeah. Since I, I know I can't use a welder. I just gotta do this, man. Okay, so... Well, I had a welder in the beginning. But I thought, okay, I'm just gonna money next to it and I can't do anything else. But I forgot that I had to... I was just playing dumb. Okay. Uh, they are indeed. How many stadiums do you have? Three, only three. <laughs> okay, let's hope he. Oh, yo. <laughs> no, that's insane. What are the odds? There was only there were only like six in the deck left. I uh, no, I'm not used to like using uh, Professor's research, and uh, I see that I have already gone through my deck pretty wildly. Well, you still have 42 cards in your deck. Oof. Okay, so going for the Eternities. I got three. Yeah, my. Um, I use three Torkals. It's enough. More than enough. Alright, so I'll just wait here. Hmm. Now I'm again in a tough spot since now at this point I don't need my welder. So, wait, how many do I have in the discard? Perfect. Okay, you know what? Okay, so we're gonna do this get our energies back into the deck. And then use money. No, 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 <laughs> I have 12. And then two heat energies. Alright, I'm pretty happy with this hand. So we've got another Torkoal, just in case we can charge him up later on. Um, no problem. Well, you will still die next turn. I, I, can really, I don't need to attack at all. So I just want... So I, I think you have something like a turbo patch in your hand. And I hope you flip a heads, mate. Ah. Well, I do see energy there. Some, uh, some good looking energies there. Uh, it's, it's gonna be, it's gonna be tasty, the energies. I'm gonna eat it. Uh huh. Torkoal is gonna swallow them whole. 
Alright, so four left in the deck. We've got another charge to Torkoal right there. You know what? Let's see if Torkoal needs to. He does need to. Okay. <laughs> so let's get that damage going. Yeah, the night tail. That's a that's a complete buster because since now you're stuck. If you can't accelerate more than three energies in one turn, you're screwed. Well, yeah. At this point, you have a dead hand as well. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Like the only thing that really counts is. Sorry. I'm gonna have a look if I can find a money, mate. I don't. I don't find a money. <laughs> Shit. Okay, I do have. Hmm. I think I should just attack, but I don't want to. Wait, I'm gonna do this. Yeah, yeah never mind. Oh wait. Okay, those were all my energies in the deck. Perfect. I'll just get them back. There's really no reason not to attack, mate. Yeah. Well, I was like, I was thinking to use nine tails or something. Like give you some time. <laughs> but yeah, so this is what the deck has, is supposed to do, and it works on almost all decks. And actually, in some cases, you just have to hunt down that energy. In uh, in decks like Eternatus, it's a good example. In decks like Eternatus, you can actually just hunt down the energy. Mhm. Mm I have four, uh, five at the moment, and I do have a giant half again. Is it because of that fire crystal and then fire uh, giant half? Like the, those are all the energies I have in my deck. Mhm. Mm That's why nine tails is so broken, man. It's so broken. But like as well. Um, in some cases, you can't. What? Sorry. Yeah, indeed. But you know those decks that just don't run any uh, energy cycle, so you just go and keep discarding all the energies until they don't have none left, and they just have to concede because they can't attack, <laughs> or they have, to, or they have the time of their life and just do whatever. All right. You want to go another match with the same deck? Well, okay, yeah, sure. That's good. All right, so I'm recording again. But uh, yeah, indeed, like Cynthia, I used her in all my decks. What is my luck with these flips? Oh no. I have, I have I a bad like start. I should make a Zashi and Zamazenta deck. Perhaps, perhaps. Well, the, Z the Zamazenta is really only. like it, uh, Most metal decks just use one Zamazenta in case they encounter VMAX yeah. Pokemon. But other than that, they just. Yeah. One is I enough. Know, like, it just kind of sits there on the bench waiting for a VMAX to jump out. Indeed. Oh my god, I just start off with my two supporters. So, now the Crobat there is just a big old nothing. And I got a Dedenne in my hands. That kind of sucks. <laughs> and I... That means I need to throw away two Fire Crystals, will be, which will be a lot of pain later on. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay, you know what? You can't switch out after that, eh? Indeed. This is an ide this is an ideal hand I have here. I'm gonna try this. Let's see what I get from this. So I'm gonna retreat my crowbar V and see if I can get something. Okay, I'm actually. <laughs> I'm actually just gonna wait here and see what happens. That's not bad to be honest. The hand it'll slow me down. Mm-hmm. I potentially slow it. 
Potentially. Yeah. Oh, back in the day, I always, I always used those that grimer. I, I love that. It's just back in the day, I thought, oh damn, that's so overkill, drawing two cards for free. But now I'm like, nah, nah. If it one draws from an attack, it's just not worth it. It technically can be killed the first turn. Mm -hmm. Right now I'm just working on getting Pokemon on my bench. I think Grimer is a good fit in this deck. Yeah, indeed. It really fits with like some decks that struggle setting up. Here comes the hammer time. Okay, let's see what I get. We got it. Okay, so we got this, and I don't want to throw away that fire crystal. I really don't. So I'm gonna do this. Which also destroys your hand. Okay, so we got another Strachi. Sorry, man. Got them two top deck emers. Uh, uh, <laughs> we're good, so... Better matchup before. Okay, what I'm gonna do is... Yeah, if you get... You like that for a second, mate. Oh, yeah, I heard, I heard. Okay, I think I've got a pretty decent start now. It was a little tough to set up. I lost some things like Nine Tails, a Fire Crystal, a Marnie. And other than that, it was alright actually. So, okay, I clear a uh, load of meowth. So, you use the, the uh, load of Persian then, the GX. Uh, <laughs> you caught me red handed. Yeah, right, okay, good. Oh no, man, not the big parasol. Oh, sure. I have such bad experience since that card actually just blocks my discarding with Torkoal. Yep. It does, and it's you very actually, annoying. You actually gave me a decent hand, so I can keep drawing with Grimer. If I were you, I'd try to get rid of Grimer as soon as possible. Grimer? <laughs> Grimer is not a, not a threat, eh? No, it really, it's I'm not. saying because he's, he's giving me cards that I need. Uh huh. I see. Kind of counteract with the Barney. I should really put more stages in this deck. Because that, that's the only one I have. Right, this this will do. Yeah, at least we got some use out of it. Oh boy, Torkoal is getting fired up. Oh, he's fired up. The I thing is, realized if I get my Obstagoon, your Torkoal can't do much. Can you? He can attack. He can detach your energies, and then you can't attack that next to him. Right, right. So I, so I should just load up the uh, Obstagoon with energies. You think? Well, if you want to, then sure. Uh, I don't complain. It might work, it might not. I'm just joking. I would say Eternatus VMAX indeed. <laughs> Eternatus VMAX is probably the best deck though. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Next it is. Okay, let's just retreat this one and get some damage going as quickly as possible. Mm. I don't know if I want to draw anything though. I don't think I will. Gotta wait until another I get really something. Card. Another really good card is Bird Keeper. In some ways, yeah, but it's uh, it's kind of situational. Like, you don't want to switch all the time, you know. And then if and that's the only card that you can use to draw, yeah, it could be a bad right. situation. <laughs> right. Well, uh, in this in this situation, yeah, since the Pokemon died. Why did you switch into another Zixigo? What? <laughs> <laughs> because I had evolved it into a Lunoon and I didn't want it to die. That but, way I get a chance to get an Obstagoon out. Wait, 
could get Eternatus and attack or something. Right. Why would I attack your Torkoal with the Eternatus? To knock it out. <laughs> no? That wouldn't be very smart. It only does 30 damage at once. Well, yeah, but I can't. Like, I, 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 I never mind, never mind. I said that didn't. <laughs> no problem. Alright, so. So, I think this is more even than before. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. We both got a an okay start. Work in progress. Indeed, work in progress. Well, as you can see, I had to put down another Jirachi, which makes means that I can't put down any Nine Tails. Yeah, I saw that. And that's what happens a lot. But sometimes you gotta give something to you know, take something. Yeah. This may be a bad idea. You would be dead already if I had an <laughs> if, uh, if I had. Okay, it was a fab it was a fabulous Nine Tails. Nice full out. I had played an event with the Obstagoon, and oh boy, it was so frustrating. He kept sw sw switching out in the alt area, and eventually I had won, but then he won because. Switching up the Obstagoon? Yeah, well, yeah. it, it was like um, he eventually just decked me out since I did not have any energy yeah. left, and he had an alt area. Which I can't damage. Right. And then eventually I just decked out because this dude just stood there and waited. I once had somebody switch out my obstacle, put it on the bench, and then bring it back into play and then save. And I was just sitting there rolling my eyes. <laughs> well, yeah, that's a way to put on. Okay, obstacle bought me enough time for now. Oh man, I need my nine tails. I gave I, I gave you cards, but I just. That nine tails would be deadly. To 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 like switch your Pokemon so I can just discard all the energies that you have. Right, I was thinking the nine tails be for a second. I was like, wait, you don't have that in here. Oh dang it, the hammer. Keep getting me with a dang hammer. Mm hmm. I could, I could poison you, but. Well, I don't really mind. Then you would give me some bench space so I can get Nine Tails going. Yeah, that's if you have a chance to. I will, I will. Are you gonna evolve this turn already? Nope, I don't have it. Oh, then that's very, very sad indeed. I would just go for the poison dude, yeah. man. Because <laughs> I, I use yeah. tool and I use a special energy, so I can't do a thing. I suppose so. Okay, let's just check. My Eternatus is definitely not at price here. But do you I have one that. Eternatus and one uh, VMAX? One VMAX, yeah. No, that's not very uh, ideal. Yeah. Because you should play like. All decks in one deck. <laughs> That's what you do. Technically. Goodbye, Meow. Oh, damn shit. Thought I had three energies in my discard pile. And I'm being waste. Uh, not entirely, it's not like you picked up one. No, 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 but it's just a waste for the fire crystal since now I don't have. Any fire crystal left in my oh no, I have okay. one left. One left. Finally, I get a chance to do something here. <laughs> Only took how long? Although that that special condition was kind of annoying. It is. I have killed an Altaria just but with the burn, and that's it. You I know the Altaria? Bye bye, energy. What you gonna do now, eh? Uh, put a grammar on the bench. If 
If only that burn stayed, then you you would have been knocked out now. And then think about what I thought. Switch or whatever. No, I don't have a switch. If only I had a 9000 now, I would have KO'd your table or whatever. Well, I, I know I don't have to worry about your eternal test, Vmax. You do not need the 9000. <laughs> your money has kept the Eastern Addis out of my hand. That just goes to show you how uh, strong it is in that department. Well, yeah, but if your deck is consistent, then it doesn't really matter. Table Eye is kind of my last big explosion with the. Uh, Normally, the it would have been like nothing, your Table Eye. Because I just gusted. it. <laughs> you know what? I'll, I'll play safe. Running. I'll play safe. Okay. Yeah, you pretty much win now. Yeah. <laughs> but even if you boss, like, your energy would have been gone.
retreating now, so. Ah, yeah, 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 I see, I see. Well, it's over anyway, mates. Subscribe.